Welcome back. Today I'll be giving you the ultimate tutorial on how to beat the new raid that came out with Season 5 of Krunker. So the idea behind the raid is that you have to beat bosses, do parkour, and collect items to board a ship and fight the final boss. And the drops you get are actually sick. So let's start. You want to be in a group with people you can communicate with or understand the game plan. Now here's the game plan. Right at the beginning, everyone except one person should get a pistol from here and go to the entrance of the crab cave, then wait for the game to begin. One of these people can get the desert eagle from here, then go to the entrance. That last person should get a pistol and go here, then wait for the game to start. When the game starts, everyone should go through the crab cave and start fighting the king crab. The person at the gate will open it, get the compass, the first item you need before the final boss, then immediately go to the crab cave to help the team. Fighting the crab is fairly easy if the whole team sticks to the plan. Firstly, you want to kill all of the little crabs. After killing all of the small crabs, you can then trap the king crab in this corner like this. No one else on the team should get close to it so it doesn't target the others. Everyone just shoots the king crab and you should be done killing it around 4.30 left on the clock. After killing the king, one player will want to go to the middle and pick up the ore. This is the second item you need before the final boss. Then you will need to do some easy parkour to get up the waterfall. After reaching the top of the waterfall, you'll want to jump into the hole, but wall jump all the way down for safety. Once you reach the bottom, one player will have to complete a parkour course around a turret to get the third and final item you need before the final boss. Grab the map, then parkour back to where you came from. Once you make it back, you're going to want to do the last parkour of the map and complete it. It's fairly simple. After making it to the end, you can then walk up to the boat and board it. Before boarding it though, along the way you're going to want to get some better weapons. The first weapon is after the waterfall parkour. When jumping down the hole, there's a little opening with an easy lava parkour. After beating it, there's a semi-auto there for you to grab. The second weapon is after doing the treasure map parkour. You can do some semi-difficult jumps and grab an assault rifle from here. But be quicker, this will happen to you. The revolver is the easiest weapon to grab and it's just right here. The last weapon you can grab is near the end. If you take this path, you can spend 75 points that you collect from killing enemies and get a FAMAS. Now that you have weapons, you can now enter the final boss. Preferably, you'll want everyone from your team there, but realistically, you'll lose about 3-5 to five people to unfortunate routes and unlucky parkour jumps. The final boss is on a ship with the ghost ship flying around spawning ghost enemies. You'll want one of your teammates to focus on the ghost enemies while the rest of your team focuses on Captain Krunk, the boss. An easy way to beat him is by getting him trapped in this corner and shooting him. After you've hit the boss for half its health, a mirror version of himself will spawn. It's possible to get both of them stuck, but kind of hard, so just have your team focus on the mirror version of himself. He has much less health, so you can beat him fairly fast. After beating him, you can easily kill Captain Krunk. After killing him, the captain's quarters open, and you can end your adventure. I hope that this tutorial helps you get all the drops that you want, and have some fun with your homies. If you want your friends and teammates to understand the plan, send them this video. I stream Krunker every day and I'll be doing raids for the next little bit, so if you want someone who knows what they're doing, come join me so we can get some drops. Have a great day.